Good morning, beautiful. I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, psychic medium and divine channeler, and this is the Daily Twin Flame reading. Please bear in mind that as a rule, I tend to read where the Divine Masculine is at and the messages coming through from the Divine Masculine. In no way, shape or form am I saying that this journey is one-sided, as I 100% know it isn't. So please do switch DM to DF if that resonates with your journey. Trust your heart always. Okay, so... As I'm talking, I'm like, mm, which cards are we using? Are we using any cards? I feel really drawn to use the Lightseer Tarot cards today. Um... feel like I want I, it you know when you're in the middle of something big and you just have to sort of pause to take a deep breath and then continue it's like just give me a minute let me take a breather or like when you're really upset and you just need to pull yourself together that feels very much like the energy here I'm like I just want to Breathe in, pull myself together and then and then get ready for movement again. It feels like a... I don't want to use a pausing energy because that sounds odd. How do I explain it? Hmm. If you're walking up a mountain, you're halfway and you're like, oh, can I actually get up there? And you just take a few moments to breathe and then get going again. It just feels like a pause in the middle, which sounds very odd, I know. Then we've got the two of wands. Okay. I want the next card too. The Divine Masculine is finding it very hard to let go and keep walking forwards from what they're leaving. So we'll say karmic because there is that is what they're needing to leave to move towards you. It's the karmic energy which is holding them back in whichever way, shape or form. And they keep looking back, but they're not going back. They're just viewing back. If that makes sense. They're just looking back. They're not moving backwards. They're still moving forwards. They're letting go. The 10 is a completion, so a new beginning. They're letting go. They're moving forwards. They're just taking their breather to gather themselves as they move further forwards. It's, um, I want to say it's automatic to look back. It would be normal. Same as if you were moving forwards from anything. It's normal to look back. It's normal to look back at what you're leaving, reassess, take a breather, find it difficult, but keep going. That is what they're doing. Then we've got the two of swords. And so it's more letting go. Okay. They're finding it hard to see clearly as they're just moving forwards and letting go. You're maybe feeling a little bit more disconnected from your twin at the moment because they are finding it hard to see forwards as they're moving forwards, okay? It's like they're in a tunnel of fog. They're finding it difficult to see further than where they're actually at. And that is making them feel their energy sort of pulled in, squished. So it's not like, it, it feels like you're not receiving, feeling the energy like you normally would. And that's hard going. It feels hard going. It feels...
exhausting. It's hard for you because you're you're feeling like they're moving away from you, but actually they're not moving away from you, they're just retreating temporarily, which is quite interesting because I've just recorded the Daily Divine Guidance and I'm pretty sure there's retreating in there too. And it's retreating from that, what I should be doing, what I need to be doing, retreating from your norm, even though you're still doing and they're retreating to sort of conserve their energy, protect themselves and continue to move forwards. It just feels like they're trying to pull any energy back they can to help them move forward. So conserving energy. Then we've got the temperance. Okay, and the temperance is about balancing the darkness with the light, which is what they're doing at the minute. They're very much trying to pull more light, move towards the light. But it's the darkness which is holding them back, the darkness which is making it more difficult. And it takes a lot of energy. This transition where they're letting go can be one of the hardest things. It takes so much energy to keep moving forwards and letting go. And they've not gone anywhere. The energy, they're just using their energy in other ways temporarily okay then we've got the eight of wands and the eight of wands is everything coming together falling into place in the light okay and that is really what is happening because the divine masculine is moving forwards to enable things to fall into place enable you two to come together in the light but they've just got to go through this last bit at the top of that mountain to get there they're doing it they're letting go all the time have faith in them okay beautiful i hope you have a fabulous day please do me a massive favor and like and comment on the video and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you take care stay safe and i will see you tomorrow namaste bye